we want to try and get the energy up high so that we can reintroduce Zap Mama and Antebellus to people. Now, normally around this time of year, they have um, celebrations in, what is it, Atlanta. And we had our first one, what was that, three years ago when we did the video with the Fela show? Two years, two, it might be three, I don't know. Anyway, so they want to keep that energy high at Music Hall. And so every February, they're going to try and bring something with that whole Afro beat um, infusion. And so with this year, bringing in Zap My Mind and Tabellus, I think it's going to kind of re-energize that, that kind of party flavor that we had. I was probably first introduced to her music in the late 80s. Um, I just, I found her music, I don't know if WDET introduced me to her music, and that's probably when Kange Zola was on there, and um, who else? It was like Kim Hunter and Kange Zola, all those older, like, I don't, I don't even want to call them DJs, but they're friends of mine at this point, but they played some really amazing music. And so, also with our um, Concert of Colors, we had an introduction to artists that came from other places and stuff that we would hear that you wouldn't hear on the radio. And so I was always kind of seeking out that kind of music, something that was different, but also something that touched my soul. So it was more like a, um, a collage of sounds when I heard her music. And because I was into um, mixed media art and I was into taking a little bit from this culture and a little bit from that culture and putting it into my work visually, when I see artists like her who does a collaboration of African and European mix, it's kind of like something that I really, really can groove to. But music is my muse. Music is what makes me um, want to create more. When I see a good dancer or hear a really good writer or a good poem, it's sort of like, oh, I want to go draw or I want to go paint. So that kind of um, gets me excited. And so her music excites me and it encourages me to keep doing what I'm doing. But she's got that kind of that mixture, that collage of sounds from all over. Because I don't think anything should just be so kind of like narrow in a box because the world is not like that anymore. And we have access to so many different things that everything should be a part of an influence of what we are. Zap Mama and Antabellus are gonna bring, you know, they're gonna bring the party. They're gonna bring the, the collage mix of music and you got a little bit of jazz, funk, um, you know, African, European, um, Afro beat, Afro fusion, Afro pian fusion. Um, they're gonna bring the party, you know. And if you have to sit down in your seat to watch them, something ain't right with you. Like you gonna have to get up and move a little bit because that music is gonna make you move. So I'm hoping that you know enough people um, know her, and if they don't, come and be reintroduced or like renewed because the stuff that we hear on the radio right now sucks actually who listens to the radio anymore i mean everybody's got their own kind of way of listening to things but without some of the local public radio stations man the world would just be ignorant to music that is like this like zap my mind and tabellus so they're coming they're live and nothing like that energy um that you can get from a streaming radio show or something on the internet, but to be able to see a musician that actually has her first instrument as her voice, and then Antebellus, who is going to, you know, the Brooklyn band that's going to actually play and see real instruments, you know, not like, you know, a digital thing, but it's real, it's tangible, you can feel it, you can see it, you can hear it, and then you can dance to it, so why not come to that?